Also, in high school, there were so many cringe people. I was cringe, but like, there were some people who were more cringe than me. There was this girl who loved anime, and she wanted to recruit me to be in the anime club. Um, and I did not want to. Like, I love anime, but I like it by myself. <laughs> I don't know if this is a social anxiety thing or if it's just my innate personality, but when I'm passionate about something, I don't like to be passionate with a group of people. I like to freak out about it by myself in my room with the door closed. <laughs> If I had to freak out with a bunch of people, all of a sudden, I don't like anime anymore. <laughs> like, all of a sudden, music is not that cool anymore. I don't know, that's just me. I have a problem. And she kept trying. She's like, I know you like anime. Join our club. And I was like, I'm in another club. Sorry. And she's like, what club are you? And I was like, go straight home after school club. She would bother me like almost every day for like two months straight. At one point, she like, just she came so close to me. Like her face was so close to my face. I know you like anime. And then she's like, oh, your skin is so nice. And then she touched my skin. Like, she touched my cheek. If you touch something nasty and then you touch my face, I'm gonna break out. Like, do not touch my face, please. Unless we're, like, very close friends or something or family members. Like, you should not be touching people's faces. But, like, she touched my face and I was like... Okay, now I'm definitely not joining this club. Even if I wanted to, you know? So. You know what the weird thing was? So, after high school, like, this was many years afterwards. When I was in retail, that same girl came into... The store that I worked with, and she had like the biggest glow up I've ever seen. Okay, this girl was nerdy with glasses. Many years later, she came to my store. Oh my gosh, she wore high heels. She had a push up bra. She had like makeup on. Like her hair was like, she, it looked like it just got done by the salon. And I'm here sweeping the dusty retail floor. And I'm just like, wow. Should have joined the anime club, maybe. <laughs> Life is fair or unfair to some people. But yeah, I don't care. I still wouldn't have joined to be age. I don't care if she turned into like a Vogue magazine model. I would still not have joined her club. I'm sorry. You know, obviously I didn't say hi because I don't think she would have recognized me because I, I also look different, but just not glowed up. <laughs> Imagine like looking different years after it, but it's not like an upgraded version. It's just you're different looking. Life is so unfair. Life is very unfair.